So we did it. We've ordered some Bermuda grass. Now this Malungai here, it's not doing so well. You see, it doesn't seem to be growing. There's a little bit of green on the end, but that's been there for months. So I think these Malungai, these bare Malungai sticks will be replanted somewhere else. So we're outside waiting for some grass to be delivered. Oh, hang on, speaking of which. Okay, so we have a delivery. This isn't our grass, it'd be something else. So it's not James grass, unless the grass fits in here. Today's the day, the grass is coming. It's not for here, it's for the back garden, although the front here, we still need to landscape. So we're just waiting for the grass to arrive. We've ordered some Bermuda grass, 80 pieces, 15 pesos a piece, and a 10 inch by 10 inch, 100 peso delivery, and it's really nice under your feet. Looks nice in the garden, especially surrounding coconut trees, which we hope that ours will grow. So where is he? He's on Filipino time, I think. Isabella's up there. She's not in her room, she's in the kids' room. There she is. She's got exams next week. Final exams, Isabella. You have your finals next week. Yay! <laughs> oh dear. Then it's the summer holidays soon. End of May, I think. I think the summer holidays here start in end of May or early June. It's different to the UK. In the UK, it's the third week of July till 1st of September or first week of September. Here in the Philippines, it's different. It's also different between the private and the public schools. The private schools tend to finish earlier and then start earlier. The public schools, a little bit later. I was talking about the water here. You can see where this pipe's been fixed. It's not our pipe, but it's just been taped up. Not a great job. See a puddle where it must be leaking every so often. This is what tends to happen in the Philippines. You get these pipes which you're responsible for and they leak, you have to fix them. Although this needs a compression coupling, really. The only thing we at the get bar. wet, the dogs will eat it. Yeah. <laughs> probably, um, in the sack. probably here for now, but we can move it somewhere. Uh, so this is the Bermuda grass. This is the type. They have it at Sabin Resort. It's quite fine mm. and it looks really nice, especially around coconut trees. Yeah. So we have some reinforcements coming over tomorrow and it's not yeah. Jane's parents. We're not no, going to put them through the, the chore of gardening, of doing our garden for us. My sister and I will help tomorrow. So we've ordered 80 and there's going to be quite a bit more Two to more come. Stuff. Two more sacks. Oh. That's, that's half of it. Mm. It's quite big, isn't it? 10 by 10? 10 inch by 10 inch. It's quite thick as well. It's nice. It'll rain. It usually does in the afternoon. 2 p.m. thunderstorm. I don't know what it is living in Leyte. It seems to rain all the time, but I'm never complaining because we love it here. And the rain is very refreshing. The garden loves it. So bring on some rain every now and then. Just a little bit. Not too much. It's all we ever dreamed of is doing things like this. So there's my pot of plants. Nothing yet. There's nothing yet come through. But uh, it's still early days. It's only been a couple of days. Oh, hang on. Hang on. We have something. A tomato. Look at this. We have success. She's doing some skipping in now. Well done. Have you seen this? I know. A tomato. Something's growing. Can you believe it? No. <laughs> what do you mean, no? You're supposed to have more faith in me. <laughs> You're supposed to encourage me. Tell me I'm doing well. Tell me it's going to grow. <laughs> Actually, I don't like tomatoes, so I don't know why I'm growing it, but they're useful. It's nice just to look. <laughs> nice to look at.
It's a bit grey, but still nice out. We're going to do a bit of gardening now. Uh, creamy boy's in his usual spot. There he is. There's Creamy boy. You alright, Creamy? How are you doing? Didn't like the rain, do you? So, as you can see from his face, he got into a fight with another dog a few days ago. He's healing well. No lasting injuries or anything. He was actually protecting us. Protecting us from other dogs. He's a good boy. He's a very good boy, Cream is. We've ordered an initial 80 pieces. 10 inch by 10 inch. 15 pesos a piece. And this bit here is where we're going to start. Let's see what we can do. We've already got some Bermuda grass here. But we need to try to fill in the gaps, so to speak. And it should join up. It's not going to be enough to do the whole garden, but it gives us a good start. And uh, we'll see how it is, see what the quality is like, see how it takes. We'll order some more, no doubt, and finish off the garden fully, the front and the back. And it'd be nice to have a lawn for once. Just waiting for Jane now. She's getting changed into a gardening clothes, although she tends to wear anything. She's not really my arte. So just waiting for Jane. And then we can get started trying to put down our Bermuda grass, trying to create a lawn here. And speaking of which, here she is. Always on Filipino time. You okay, my darling? Yeah. You ready to do this? Yes. Ready to have a lawn? Yeah. Finally. After, after all these months, waiting for the weather to turn. And ironically, there's a lot of rain on the way at the moment. Mm. The El Nino, is it? La Nina. La Nina? La Nina. La Nina. That's, uh, what's that mean? Uh, rainy. Lots of rain. Lots of rain. So we're going to go get started. Uh, James got our gloves. I need to go and get my gloves. Oh. <laughs> I don't know how he managed to get two of these on his bike. This is heavy. Very heavy. He got two of those on his bike. That's <laughs> the light one. Oh dear, we're useless. Okay, let's go. Ready? Go. Ah. All right, here we are. That's better. Almost there. Almost there. Got a stain on my shoe. Ah. Okay, there. Okay. Oh, I got a stain on my shoe. Go away. 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 Go
gross, isn't it? No, it's 80 pieces, yeah. different sizes, but 10 by 10 inch. Mm. We didn't think it would be enough, but well, we know it's definitely not enough now, but we need to get more. It's a good start though. It looks like it's good quality. Obviously it need a little bit of time to establish some roots to grow thick in fall. Oh, what's Jane doing? <laughs> Jane has the attack. What's that for? I'm gonna cut the malungay. Oh yeah. The one at the back's a bit tall, is that the one? Yeah, yeah. You're gonna cut it all down? Yeah. This is a tall one. Grow so quickly. Yeah, yeah. Careful, go in your forehead. Don't let it drop, huh? Alright. When it's almost. Be careful with your hand, eh? Okay. Oh my goodness. I'll do it. Okay, careful. It's okay, don't worry. Oh, you're, you're almost in your finger. Really? That's it. Yeah, that's fine, yeah. Oh gosh, I, I told you. I can't get close. I can't get close enough. Okay, let me do it. Here we are. You need to cut the skin on the thingy. There we are. On my head. Oh gosh. <laughs> Run. Watch your head. <laughs> Just let it stand on the ground, Ali, if you can. Just stand it in that. So lots of malungai here. We have lots. It grows easy, doesn't it? Mm. You can make malungai ice cream. <laughs> Dang it! Oh, what is that? What? Did you not see? No. What spider? No, Ant? This. Can you not see? It's still moving, moving at the end of that thing. Okay, he's got his he's got his tail arched ready to attack. It's like a scorpion. He's very camouflaged. Yeah, I thought it was just Malunga. It's green.